Hey guys, this is food. It says this is food. Have you seen that? Well, they sell these things in Europe, in Germany. I don't know where else in Europe. But is is this food? That's my question. Is this food? <laughs> Does this look like food to you? Would a lion in the savanna think ever think that this is a food for you? It's pretty provoking that they write onto this bottle if it didn't have this design and these paintings. It's just a bottle that they write onto it. This is food. It's actually confusing people on purpose, manipulating people on purpose. Right? It's not telling the truth. This is food. First of all, it's a drink. And my point here is, this is definitely not an advertising. This is the antidote of advertising. They also give you the Nutri score. I don't know if you have that in the USA or from wherever you're listening in. But in Germany or in Europe, we have this Nutri score since a few years actually. And I think that's conditioning people for the social score that's coming probably by 2030 or something with all also Shufa and all these things they tie into this I don't know if you know about these situations in Europe have you ever been in Europe lived in Europe but they have Shufa which is something that is a credibility you know they have all your data if you ever couldn't make any payment then you will have there an entry and for example when you want to rent flats um, simple as that then they check Shufa or you want to rent a car they check that Shufa and if you have an entry then you're not eligible and there are so many homeless now just because they have an entry in this Shufa and they cannot get or find any flats because they have conditioned landlords into asking for these things obviously and then yeah that's how they do it let's talk about this food this is food because it's not food i bought this for four euros and i can get a bunch of bananas for four euros i mean it's uh, an abomination what they're doing they sell this stuff for four euros, they mix something together. If I put four bananas or five bananas in a blender, I get the same amount. And it's actually food, you know. But this is just punched together. You see, that's a li there is no, no other drink that has a long list like this of ingredients. Of course, they're listing this to make people think, oh, it's healthy. Because they give you all the vitamins here they lay it all out for you at the same time they say it's lactose free but when you look here it's German but it's fat reduced milk is the first ingredient at the same time they're saying it's lactose free okay and they twice they say milk protein okay I mean what else do you need My point is this is not food, this is some drink, a mixture that is punched together by a manufacturer and they can call this plant-based, it should be written somewhere, I'm not sure where it's written, maybe they don't have this label, but people will call this plant-based because there is fiber in it. And that's how plant-based the labeling works. There is actually no real law to how they can use these um, labels, such as vegan or plant-based. There are some laws to it, but not clear laws to when they can use these things. And they would call this plant-based simply because there is some trace of fiber in it, which it also says here, oat fiber, half a faser, 
that's old fiber okay and there's another fiber mice fiber um, mice is corn corn fiber so what they're doing is they just take some wood fiber actually what you can do is just take this piece of wood scrub some wood from it then you mix it together with milk or water and then you can call it plant-based you see what the point is what I'm trying to tell you here that they can just use some traces of something that can be wood like this or actual corn or what they say oat and then they take it as a base as a chemical base and they just mix it into the drink and it's not even 20% of the of the mixture but they can call it plant based just because of this okay while the rest is some chemicals mostly sugar and then they add artificially add aromas all these things uh, chemically manufactured in a lab there are no real things in this okay nothing is real in this that's like completely produced manufactured in a lab and they even say on the nutri score it's a that stands for the best thing that you can get and obviously this is to manipulate people into thinking that oh if there's an a i can buy it and it's gonna be healthy but they have to think about these things i mean i don't drink it i bought it for four euros um uh, i think obviously you can drink it but it's not healthy i think not the way they try to manipulate people into this and first of all they say it's a people are being manipulated by this then they say this is food and people just believe it you know i still hope i still believe actually that there are people out there that don't buy these things and that these things are just in the shelves and supermarket shelves lingering there for years okay because nobody buys these things because everybody sees through these things but there are some people especially in the vegan community i guess that that jump onto any um narrative these days or any movement so to say any new trend and they would buy this thing and they would feel super cool when they are at work and they have this thing and yeah you know they put it on the table and everybody can see this and they pride themselves with these things because it's it costs four years look i'm so rich i can afford these things and it's all healthy but it's all just a big lie okay this is not food but they write on to it this is food to condition the people because soon you get anything out of these bottles okay you can have a wiener schnitzel out of these bottles that is mixed together or whatever you know you can have um meat meatballs or, or whatever you're eating burgers anything will be available in these drinks and then you're just drinking right there will be no actual meat anymore that you're eating because they say well it has everything in it as they say here um it's it's eligible for um for a full meal that's what they say somewhere there um ausgewogenen trinkmahlzeit which means um that's um what they say that this this can replace a whole meal that's what they're saying okay so this is wh where the supermarket products are hurting the people towards okay and the manufacturers there i mean you have to question many things that are being offered in the supermarkets but this is one of them okay and again way too expensive for i mean what's inside here <laughs> what are we paying here for four euros okay is it the design is it the machines that they are using to punch these things together though so there you get it this whole list here i've actually never seen a drink with such a long list 
okay if they need to make such an effort to put so many ingredients up there in such a long list I mean you can already guess that something's cooking you know something's up not in the good sense cooking because what ingredients are in a banana in a bunch of banana do they write anything here on the background oh there are vitamins there is this protein in banana get vitamin B whatever nothing's written on it because the banana is what a banana is and you can eat it and it's real food but this <laughs> this is not food they left space I think here exactly for to write not okay you can do this for yourself this is not food and I can't stress it enough people have to really be aware or become aware of these things because soon if people keep buying these things soon you're gonna get anything out of bottles as I said before um, cereals uh, yeah burgers meat steaks whatever you've been using and the thing is uh, whatever you've been eating and the thing is why they give it to you in these bottles is because they can mix in their their insect powder this stuff you know that is also then um, considered protein right and everybody jumps onto the, this train again oh it's high protein high protein we need protein they sell you these ideas and then whenever they put something into the supermarket that says high protein then you're buying it just because you're already influenced and manipulated by this trend media trend oh I need protein protein where do I get my protein from this is how they play you like the Pied Piper is playing a song for the rats and they follow him okay so be aware of these things and what I can do is just throw it away now